What's up KC Bowling? My name is Connor Rogas, a teammate of Connor Lackey, and today I will be here doing the ball review on the GB5 Solid. So the GB5 has the enhanced V2 core with the GB 12.7 Solid cover stock. It has an RG of 2.48 and a diff of .048. So we're going to get into the take 10, so we're going to throw 10 different shots with this, kind of bowling on the 44 foot pattern, so let's see how it goes. So the GB5 is the newest Ebonite solid, so it's the big, one of the bigger solids that I've thrown. So bowling on a 44 foot burned up mystery pattern, so let's see how this goes. Pretty good shot there. So this ball has fit into my bag really well. So it's bigger on the symmetric end of the spectrum. Where, so kind of gives me a ball down from the A-Sims when I need it. But this ball is super continuous, even from as far left as I am playing, which is super nice to see out of a solid. So try and throw one a little bit better here. That was a really good one. Just high, getting the nine pin out there. But this ball is super continuous. I've thrown a lot of the game breakers over, over the span of my life. And GB4 Pearl is my big favorite. But when I heard about this one, had to get it. We're gonna make a small two and one here after that almost nine pin. So let's see how this goes. So even after making that move, the ball still is really continuing around the corner, coming off of it really hard, which is really good to see. So this ball just has a standard pin-up layout for me, one of the more basics. And right now there's a little lane shine, so not anything too big of surface-wise. So we're gonna creep another one as that one still went a little bit high. bit light there but was able to get the four pin to kind of come flying across the deck so this ball is definitely going to be one for me that I use a lot more on, on tournaments on the harder stuff higher volume patterns so I've bowled a couple tournaments with it so far and I'm really really like what I see so we're gonna say that one just kind of make sure we get all of that at the bottom Well, that's a little to the right. Came flying back. So, this ball is really something special. And I think it complements uh, a lot of the ASIM stuff super well. So, when you need that ball down, you need something that's continuous, but you don't need it to be really going dead sideways off the end of the pattern. This one's a super good option. So, halfway through the shots. So, I'm gonna kind of throw that one even. We're gonna throw that one again. That one got a little to the right the last time. Well, that's even farther to the right. Yeah, that one was slow, a little quick right. So that was not a great pass, but we'll make a little move off that too. This ball is not having any problems coming off of the end of the pattern right now. This is the leftovers from youth tournament the past weekend, so they're already hooking a ton. So we're gonna go actually another two and one. Just to be safe. Make sure we get this one going to the tracers down lane. So two and one might have been a little bit too much. So we'll creep the one back. So seven shots in, five for seven. So this ball, this ball's really impressive even from 
how far left we are on the lane. Right now, I'm looking about 22, 23, trying to throw it to like eight, nine down lane, just right to them tracers. So, let's make sure we just throw one a little bit better here. Well, that one's to the right. Two pin. So, they're definitely a little bit squirrely out there to the right. So, might have to move my break point in a little bit. So, I might go a little one and one right and kind of just try and parallel it a little bit more. Just to try and get that ball to face up and see it sooner. So, two more shots. So, let's see. really good yeah so that one was a lot better didn't get as far to the right and really allowed the ball to kind of shape up so one more shot here we're gonna go stay in that same spot we're gonna throw one a little bit farther to right and see if we can get this one to kind of come off it and maybe throw some pins around so the last shot here That's a really good one to end on. So that's the GV5 solid, so thanks for watching.